the S&P 500, ticker symbol SPY. In this video, we're going over my trade idea of the week and the day-by-day -day probability model. So let's start off with the tunnel analysis on the 1R chart. With our main and pause of MACD, we're back at overbought levels with the RSI. With the 4R chart, we are in pause of MACD and at overbought condition with the RSI. We're still above the 200 moving average, this green line, acting as temporary support at a price of $436.26. And as with the daily chart, we still remain in negative MACD. And as with the trade idea, my trade position size for is less than 1% of my portfolio. My long entry is at $414.20, and that is this range here. My sell target is at $456.10, and my stop loss is at $398.75. However, if I were to open a short position, my entry is at $465.20, my sell target is at $430.60, and my stop loss is at $474.84. So whichever entry price were to hit first, that will be my position of the week. So how did I develop these trade ideas? It all comes from the day-by-day -day probability model, and as we progress to the fifth day, or week of trading, the S&P 500 has a 43% chance to climb between 0 to 6%, a 21% chance to climb between 6 to 12%, to the downside, a 29% chance to fall between 0 to negative 6%, and a 7% chance to fall between negative 6 to negative 12%. So if you enjoyed this content, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and thank you for watching.